The second last day of the AFL trade period has come to a close and we still haven't had a lot of movement. Only a couple of small time trades were done today and there's only five hours worth of trades left tomorrow on the final day. So expect it to be a busy day on the final day of trade period. But for today, there was a couple of small time trades. Fremantle traded Harley Ballack to Melbourne in exchange for pick 66. Harley Ballack was drafted pick 38 back in the 2015 draft. And over his two seasons at Fremantle, he only managed four games, which he played all this year. And he wanted to go back to Victoria. So Melbourne and Fremantle have managed to get a deal done there. The other deal that was made today was between the Adelaide Crows and the Gold Coast Suns. Adelaide traded Harrison Wig and pick 54 and a future fourth round draft pick. In exchange, Gold Coast gave Adelaide pick 39. Harrison Wig was drafted pick 35 back in the 2014 draft. And in his three seasons at the Adelaide Crows, Harrison Wig hasn't managed to play a game for the Crows. So going over to the Gold Coast, he's got an opportunity and he will likely play games. He actually can win the footy in the SANFL. He's been able to average 23 disposals over the season. So he can win the footy. And I think he'll be a good addition to the Gold Coast who need those ball gatherers in the midfield. He actually impressed me quite a bit in the GRT preseason series this year. He looked quite promising. And I was actually surprised that he didn't get a game even round one with the Adelaide Crows. I actually had him... As a cash car, my Supercoach team had to remove him before the start of the season. So for those of you who are into Supercoach and fantasy footy, look at Harrison Wig as a possible cash cow. Now that he's at the Gold Coast, he should definitely get some games in 2018. But I expect it to be a busy day tomorrow for the final day of the AFL trade period. We've only had eight trades in this whole period. It's been a very quiet period. But I expect it to ramp up tomorrow. Gary Ablett, the deal still has to be done. Is Charlie Cameron going to get to Brisbane? Is Bryce Gibbs going to go back to Adelaide? We'll find out tomorrow and I'll keep you guys posted. I'm going to go the barrel. That's the only way we're going to get penetrate this breeze. Some good pen... What? No. That doesn't make sense. Aaron Hall off the ground. That's how you got to get him. Scrap them through.